I want to close by praying to the Lord for you. May this priceless soul's path remain illuminated by your heavenly guidance. Give them courage to face their painful memories, insight into their value, and tranquility to recognize that the past deeds of others don't determine their destiny. Remind them to have faith in their journey. I am deserving of love, respect, and happiness, and I will no longer tolerate maltreatment. Repeat these affirmations with me if this message speaks to you. I embrace who I truly am and allow others to see me for who I truly am. I have the will and bravery to end the cycle of misery and bring about constructive change in my life. In the midst of choices and uncertainties, treasure the love and respect you have developed for yourself and those around you. Let your heart radiate the peace you discovered, unruffled. Bless yourself with the bravery to make decisions that are in your best interests. You are completely in control, therefore you may relax knowing that you are in charge and will always choose what is best for you. There is a time for everything, and God has a plan. And now, Israel, what does the Lord your God ask of you but to fear the Lord your God, to walk in obedience to him, to love him, to serve the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul? The universe is getting you back on your feet for the greatest comeback of your life. No man can curse what God has blessed. The enemy comes to steal, kill and destroy, but there is no plan he can form that will stop what God has planned for your life from manifesting. No weapon formed against you shall prosper. You can be impacted by the objects and people around you, but if you safeguard your inner tranquility, and when you are content, you will feel stronger and better prepared to handle any ups and downs that may occur. You become what you think about the most. One of history's greatest secrets is this. They will pay close attention to your requirements, consistently inquire about your day, and genuinely care about your welfare. The most potent tool in the universe is your imagination. The cosmos is telling you to be kind to yourself. For the investigation you conducted, you had a gut feeling that growth was conceivable. Angels urge you to be aware of impending change. They are cunning and dishonest, and they are ensnaring you with their charisma and charm. Now, everything in your life will start to advance. You'll notice a change from shortage to abundance, from stagnation to flow, from confusion to clarity, and from agony to calm. The pivotal moment is at hand. You should pay attention to the signs that your angel is giving you. Never feel obligated to support someone financially, especially if they are unwilling to contribute in other ways to the relationship. You stopped encouraging your inner critic and started speaking only encouraging words to yourself. You have a ton of brand new opportunities coming up. Be incredibly patient as you develop. When a mistake is made, instead of punishing yourself for making a mistake, learn to appreciate it. Type yes if you believe in God. God bless you.